Yeah, that's right, Jeff. We have a small contingent here outside the uh, third base gate here at Truist Park. And just moments ago, the Braves bus is pulled up here outside Truist Park. We saw the likes of uh, Terry McGurk. We saw manager Brian Snitker here, Freddie Freeman with his son and uh, son Charlie and wife Chelsea. Uh, with Freddie hoisting the World Series trophy here. Just walked inside Truist Park moments ago. You can see uh, the players and their families still getting off the bus to rowdy cheers and applause here from, I would say, probably a couple dozen, not three dozen fans out here braving the cold weather and the rain to say welcome home. Congratulations. You see relief pitcher Jesse Chavez, reliever Luke Jackson and his family. And the Luke, Luke cheers <laughs> accompanying them. This is a, uh, a fan base incredibly happy right now after the Braves uh, wrapped up the World Series victory in Houston, meaning so much to this team, Jeff, as you, you know, and not just the team, the fan base, but the area. City of Atlanta, you've seen the parade plans. You've heard about those. If not, go to 11live.com. But number of school districts closing in anticipation of this parade Friday at noon. That will be in two parts in downtown Atlanta as well as Cobb County here. So as you can see, I mean, the players, uh, there's there's Christian Pache there walking in. Uh, <laughs> this, this fan base is just elated on another level right now. Uh, Atlanta, not not used to this sort of fanfare, but here it is. We, we have arrived, uh, Jeff, and we are just a couple of days out from this parade, the world champion Atlanta Braves. Let's show you a little bit of the fans right now. We oh, yeah, Take a look. They've already got their World Series merchandise. Uh, Freddie Freeman, Fathead. There's some more World Series championship gear. This is a small bunch, Jeff, no doubt about that, but they are happy to be here as you can hear. Let's go Braves! 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 Woo! Oh no! How you doing, bro? I don't know, dude. You get the ring too? Waiting on the <laughs> okay, he's coming back to me. You okay? Yeah, yeah. That's all I see. I can, I got you. Yep. Yeah, I would just let that probably still have my ear on there. Most of the players are uh, off the buses now for the most part and their families as well. Seeing them with their families, you can tell that, you know, they're tired. This is a, a, a season that has uh, tried this team so much, but in the end, they have won the World Series. They've come back from Houston today after enduring a, a small weather delay coming out of Houston. But uh, you, can, you can just see from the smiles you'll see coming up throughout our newscast tonight just how uh, excited and how committed they are to this fan base that never quit on this team, even though a lot of experts, uh, maybe even some fans too, gave up on this team a few months ago. But you can tell from this faithful 50 or so that, you know, the, the fans are excited. Let's hear it. 
Uh, how excited are you guys oh, right man, now? We're really excited, man. I can't even. So excited. After, after after the season and after everything we've been through in the past like few years and like all the trouble we, you know, uh, failing those series yeah, yeah, and coming back and like getting that monkey off our back and and doing it with the same core of people, you know, the same core of guys. That's huge for them. It's huge for their confidence. And I am so happy for those guys. They work hard. Freddie's the franchise man. He's been here for years. He does it. You know, he's earned it. You know, Snitker, 45 years in the same organization. Like, who does that? When do you ever see that? Never, you know what I mean? And he's, like, seeing stories like that. We had every piece. We had every piece, every personality, every every guy that we needed. We had the power. We had the personality. We had the charisma. We had the leadership. We had everything. All ingredients yeah. for a winning strategy yeah, here in 2021. You couldn't have written a better ending for a team that went through so much, Jeff.